We begin with a tragedy in Fairhope. Two people severely burned after their home caught fire. It happened at a trailer park on Highway 181. A witness says the woman was literally on fire as she ran out of that home. Our Baldwin County reporter Michael Ward joining us now live from the scene. Michael, bring us up to date. Well, nothing official yet, Byron. Um, a lot of posts on social media, but nothing we can confirm right now. We do know both victims were flown to the burn center at University Hospital over in Mobile. Uh, certainly a horrifying afternoon here. So we want to warn you what you're about to hear is disturbing. The house was exploding. A fire gutting a Fairhope mobile home. The man and woman inside, neighbors said, were on fire when they got out of the home. Both of them remained conscious the whole time. They just wanted water and they were just in a lot of pain. Melita Metzler saw the horrifying scene unfold, jumping in with her mother to help the two victims. Grab the blanket and try to cover her up. We had to go across the street and pick her up and carry her over here because she was on fire. My mom was sitting behind her the whole time, holding her up, trying to keep her cool. Her skin was just falling off of her. Helicopters taking the man and woman to the South Alabama Burn Center. Metzler says she never thought twice about jumping into hell. It's just an automatic reaction. I mean, every human being should, should do it. I mean, whether it's your life involved or not, you should automatically want to help. I spoke to another gentleman as I pulled up tonight who shared his story of jumping in in this scenario, trying to help the male victim in, in this situation. Still trying to find an update, get an update for you on the victim's conditions, but certainly prayers are needed. We are live in Fairhope. I'm Michael Warwick, Fox 10 News.